Hi guys, in today's video we're going to be doing something a little bit different and we're going to be looking at how to make some really cool bottle rockets. Firstly, we're going to look at the things that you need. Firstly, you're going to need some empty bottles. You're going to need something for legs like pencils or straws. You're going to need some vinegar. You're going to need some baking soda or baking powder. And you're also going to need a cork that will fit in firmly into the end of the bottles that you are using. First thing you need to do is to attach the legs to the bottle. So you can see here I've used pencils and I'm using these with the rubber end down so it's easier to stand on, it's got a little bit more grip because there's a bit more friction with the rubber end. But you can use anything as long as they're obviously all the same length and as long as it will stay and stand steadily. Now if you want you can decorate your bottle, I haven't done it this time, but you can put some things on, try to make it a bit more aerodynamic if you think you know how. That is our bottle rocket essentially made. First thing we need to create the fuel. So firstly you're going to put the vinegar into the bottle. Now this will change depending on the size of the bottle. You need more vinegar for a bigger bottle and less for a smaller bottle, but you can experiment and test that out yourself. Now is the part that we have to be fast with. We need some sort of funnel, I just used cardboard here in the video that you're going to see, in order to put the bacon soda into the bottle. Now what you need to do is put the bacon soda into the vinegar as quick as you can, and quickly remove the funnel and put the cork in the top of the bottle, turn the rocket over, put it down on the floor, get away as quick as you can before it takes off. Now you can see the bottle rocket's taking off. Now what's actually happening, is the vinegar, which is a liquid, and the powder, which is a solid, they're combining together to create a gas. Okay, now that gas is filling up the bottle. And when it gets too much for the bottle, it's got nowhere to go, it blows the cork out of the bottle and pushes the bottle up with loads and loads of force, which is why we need to get out of the way. If it doesn't work at first, don't worry, I had a couple of failed attempts getting the amounts of vinegar and bacon powder right. Just keep going and you'll get it done. With this video you can see my rocket didn't really take off so I had to go in and gently move the cork to release some of the pressure when it took off. Now that meant I was covered in vinegar. Please, please, please don't do this. Get an adult to do this for you if this happens for you. So there's some bottle rockets. I hope you enjoyed the video. Until next time, see you later.